G'day, g'day. Well, this week's fishing location is Combsley, behind the hockey fields, the Combsley Beach. Now, this has been a difficult area to fish in the past because of all these mudflats, but things have changed because of this new jetty. Let's have a look at your options. Whilst there's been a nice sandy beach here for quite a long period of time, even a long cast only puts you in a few feet of water. This jetty puts you past all the mud flats out into a, about a metre of water at the edge on the bottom of the tide. So the top of the tide you've probably got two metres of water. Now this is a monstrous platform. It's got to be one of the largest on the Brisbane River that allows fishing. If you're into land based shark fishing this wouldn't be a bad option either. We're upstream of the gateway but it's not a bad part of the river. You do get threadfin salmon here as well. And if you do happen to land that big one, there's fish cleaning table here as well. With running water. I usually try and include somewhere where you can take the kids, and this sandy beach is ideal. There's not a bad boat ramp and a floating pontoon, but it does get quite busy, so it makes it very difficult to fish off. Another option of this place is an evening fish for flathead. These lights here attract bait fish, and that attracts flathead. Just a matter of throwing some soft plastics or bait around these lighted areas, you've got a good chance of an evening. Now if jetties and floating pontoons aren't your thing, you can always wade out to these rocks here. Because it's fairly shallow, the time to fish these is right on the top of the tide, where you do get good brim. Now, the best time to fish this location is obviously the top of the tide because of the mud flats. That jetty would be an ideal platform for live baiting for a threadfin salmon or maybe even a jewfish. And you do get mullet around here and herring around the jetties with the cast net. And this is the ideal place if you want family activities as well as a bit of fishing thrown in. Have a look at some of the facilities here. There's a small play area, a couple of swings and a slippery slide, a few rides. Nothing too elaborate but enough to keep the kids entertained for a little while. And you can even bring the dog, there's an area here fenced off so you can let the dog off the lead. Some great park areas for the kids to run wild. And even a really nice area for barbecues. That's quite easy to find, we're west of the Gateway Bridge or upriver of the Gateway Bridge. You go along Linton Road until you see a turn off called Cole Gardner Road, turn in there. This is the Combsley hockey fields that you've got to weave your way through. It's a tarred road, all weather access. Just follow it through until you get right around the back, then you'll see the jetty and all the facilities.